Have you ever gazed at the night sky and wondered how it all began? How did our universe with its countless galaxies, stars, and planets come into existence? Today, we're delving into one of the most profound scientific theories that explains the origin of everything we see around us, the Big Bang Theory. Stay with us as we explore the birth of the universe and the evidence that supports this groundbreaking idea. To understand the Big Bang Theory, we need to travel back in time, far beyond the formation of Earth, the stars, and even the galaxies. Let's rewind the cosmic clock to a moment over 13.8 billion years ago, when the universe was unimaginably different from what we know today. In the beginning, the universe was in a state of extreme density and temperature. It wasn't a bang in the traditional sense, but rather a rapid expansion from an incredibly hot and dense state. This moment marks the birth of our universe, a point known as the Big Bang. But what exactly happened during the Big Bang? According to the theory, the universe expanded from a singular point, a state of infinite density and temperature. This expansion was incredibly rapid, causing space itself to stretch and cool down, leading to the formation of the fundamental particles that make up everything around us. Within the first fractions of a second after the Big Bang, the universe cooled just enough for quarks, the building blocks of protons and neutrons, to form. As the universe continued to expand and cool, these quarks combined to create protons and neutrons, which then formed atomic nuclei. About three minutes after the Big Bang, the universe had cooled sufficiently for the nuclei of hydrogen and helium, the simplest and most abundant elements, to form. This period is known as nucleosynthesis, and it laid the foundation for the chemical elements we see in the universe today. However, the universe was still in a hot, dense state, filled with a plasma of charged particles and radiation. This plasma was opaque, meaning light couldn't travel freely. It wasn't until about 380,000 years after the Big Bang that the universe cooled enough for electrons to combine with nuclei, forming neutral atoms. This event, known as recombination, allowed light to travel freely for the first time, creating what we call the Cosmic Microwave Background Radiation CMBR. The Cosmic Microwave Background Radiation, or CMBR, is a faint glow that fills the universe, providing a snapshot of the universe just 380,000 years after the Big Bang. It is one of the most compelling pieces of evidence supporting the Big Bang Theory. Discovered in 1965 by Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson, the CMBR is a critical clue that has helped scientists understand the early stages of the universe's evolution. With the universe now transparent, gravity began to take hold, pulling together the slightly denser regions of gas into clumps. Over millions of years, these clumps of gas collapsed to form the first stars and galaxies. This process of cosmic evolution led to the large-scale structures we observe in the universe today. From the majestic spiral galaxies to the dense star clusters, the universe has continued to evolve and grow more complex over billions of years. The Big Bang Theory not only explains the origin of the universe, but also provides a framework for understanding the formation and evolution of cosmic structures. But how do we know all this? The Big Bang Theory is supported by a wealth of observational evidence. Besides the cosmic microwave background radiation, astronomers have observed the redshift of distant galaxies, which indicates that the universe is expanding. This discovery, made by Edwin Hubble in the 1920s, showed that galaxies are moving away from us, and the further away they are, the faster they are moving. This is exactly what we would expect if the universe started from a single point and has been expanding ever since. Another piece of evidence comes from the abundance of light elements, such as hydrogen, helium, and lithium, in the universe. The Big Bang nucleosynthesis model predicts the relative amounts of these elements produced in the early universe, and observations match these predictions remarkably well. Modern cosmology also relies on computer simulations to model the evolution of the universe from the Big Bang to the present day. These simulations, based on the laws of physics, produce structures that closely resemble the cosmic web of galaxies and clusters we observe. While the Big Bang theory is widely accepted, 
it is not without questions and mysteries. Scientists continue to explore phenomena such as dark matter and dark energy, which make up most of the universe's mass energy content but remain largely mysterious. These ongoing investigations could provide new insights and potentially refine our understanding of the universe's origins. As we look to the future, the Big Bang Theory provides a framework for predicting the universe's ultimate fate. Will it continue expanding forever, or will gravity eventually halt and reverse this expansion? Current evidence suggests that the universe will keep expanding, driven by a mysterious force known as dark energy. The Big Bang Theory is a testament to human curiosity and our desire to understand the cosmos. It tells a story of a universe that began in a hot, dense state and has been expanding and evolving ever since. As we continue to explore and discover, we deepen our appreciation of the vast and wondrous universe we inhabit. Thank you for joining us on this journey through time and space. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more fascinating explorations with science and physics. Until next time, keep looking up and marveling at the wonders of our universe.